Hey guys, it's Jimmy here, back out again on a Dragonville mini episode. Today we're doing Dragonville mini episode 21. I'm pretty excited to get into this with you guys today. I want to show you guys first the Oni Dragon and also Spear Dragons, Young Form, Team Form, then Adult Form. Then after that, we're actually going to get the Gargoyle Dragon, which is a pretty cool one. I actually did upgrade Kairos early on on the week. I actually missed taps. So we can look at this right here. So we're going to go to the Kairos real quick. I'm going to show them. So yesterday, after I recorded the... How to breed the new rift dragon i accidentally mistapped on the game and upgrade kairos so that was my bad guys i did a mistake hopefully you guys can um go with today's video still nonetheless that even though we can't get kairos so we're gonna get the gargoyle dragon today so i'm pretty excited to do that with you guys so first thing i want to do is show you guys that i actually got all the rift dragons now i actually got the new one recently i actually got it today i paid five thousand after the video i made and i actually got it so it's pretty cool so i'm going to show you this dragon's Young form, team form, then adult form real quick. Okay, guys? Does that sound good? So this is what it looks like as a young form. Pretty cute little guy. Now, this is what he's going to look like as a teen. He looks pretty cool. Looks like a snow wolf dragon. Now, that is pretty sick, I must say. Now, let's take him to level to his final adult form, which is this is right here. Looks even more cooler. I love the snowflake patterns, like the sharp snowflake that comes out of his animation, which is pretty cool. He does um, a little begging for some food, which is pretty awesome. And he's a cold earth and also rip dragon, zero incubation time, and is automatically with a cold treat every time. Pretty cool, though, dude. But yeah. Next, I'm going to show you the Zephyr dragon's young form, team form, then adult form. Then I also want to show you guys the Lulukin dragon's young form, team form, then adult form, too. So this is Lulukin's dragon right here. It is always a water rate trait dragon, my bad. Um, and this is why it looks like it's a young form. Now let's take it to its teen form real quick. So this is what it's going to look like as a teen. Pretty cool little guy. I'm excited to see what his adult form is. I actually seen his adult form, so what am I saying? Um, hopefully you guys are excited to see it too. So this is what he's going to look like as his adult form. He's slightly bigger and he's pretty cool. He's a light and dark dragon, rift only type, and also, not rift only type, but you know what I mean. Uh, zero incubation time is always of a rare trait of water. But yeah. Sadly, there's no way of purchasing these yet. Hopefully later on they do though. The next is the Zephyr Dragon right here, guys. It is a cold and lightning rift dragon. Zero incubation time and is a metal trait every time around. So yeah, pretty cool. Young form, teen form, and finally adult form. Pretty cool little dude, if I say so myself. I like this dragon a lot because its pattern on its wings looks like lava. So it's pretty sick, to say less. Nonetheless. My bad. But yeah. So Kairos' ability now does 23 hours and has 18 level power. That's pretty cool. And now it's 5,000, no, 5,000, 9,500 in order to upgrade him again to max level, level 19. So it's pretty exciting once we do that. I will make sure not to click, misclick again, because that was my bad for misclicking. And I feel really upset with myself and disappointed. So yeah, I just want you guys to know I'm very sorry about that. Okay, so let's go collect a dragon from the Coliseum and let's try to breed some cool dragons in the Rift also. Since I got some candy corn, I mean, not candy corn, but Rift crystals to do. Let's place our lightning dragon on in. We've already collected the max amount. So let's first go get the gargoyle dragon. So now we're going to go to creepy. No, it's not a creepy. That's the last dragon we want to get. Brawly. Gargoyle. I figured out how to pronounce it. I was like, huh, maybe this is something I know to pronounce that's really easy. I'm like, gargoyle. I'm like, oh, I can't believe I mispronounced that the first video. But nonetheless, I figured out how to pronounce it. 15 minute incubation time. Not 15 minute, but 15 hour incubation time. It is the Earth, Water, Cold, Lightning Dragon, 7 gold per minute at this time. But we'll see what it looks like at this level 15. And that's how much it's going to produce. Okay. So let's go level 15 with this little dude. I got to collect my chest later on in Clash Royale. So yeah. Now, this is what it looks like as an egg. This is what it looks like as a young form. Pretty cute little dude right here. Now let's level this dude up, okay? I'm pretty excited to do this with you guys. So let's go over here. You've collected 100,000 XP from this. So sweet, that's awesome. Now let's name this little dude Dragon real quick. Dragon. There we go. So, this is what it looks like as young form. Now let's take him to his teen form real quick. That's gonna be level four. So this is what he's gonna look like as a teen form. Pretty cool little dude. Pretty scary also, and yeah. Yeah, he would scare me if I saw this fly to my house. Uh, now let's take him to level eight. 
See what he looks like bigger? So this is why he's gonna look like a level eight. That's pretty cool. I love his wingspan. It's pretty bony like. That's that's cool. Now let's take him to level 15. I wanna see how much he reduces at level 15. That's my big thing. I wanna see here. So at level 15, he will produce 87 per minute. And is still a cold earth water dragon and lightning. Slightly better breeding odds, 15 hour incubation. By the way, guys, I did figure out you can actually breed all the rift dragons within the co-op breeding cave. So if somebody was to place a spear dragon in the co-op breeding cave and I bred a ghost dragon with it, I could breed it. Which is pretty cool and pretty handy to have in this game. So so if you guys need a friend with uh, these dragons, you can either friend me or somebody on a group site. Usually there's group sites on Facebook if you want to go check on one. Uh, I go to um, Dragon Veil Befriending Group. That's where I do. I hang out with friends there and we chat usually. And I also go to Dragonville Breeding Group. Those are two really good Facebook sites if you want to go there and get some more friends. But yeah. Or you guys can share each other's Facebook friend name in the description area. That always helps. Also, by the way, guys, we will not be doing Dragonville Minecraft. I'm actually having problems recording that recently, so I'm not going to be doing that. Um, but I will do this. I will place the link to the mod pack in the description area if you want to download Dragonville Minecraft. It is 1.6.4 version. Meaning that it's very old download. I think there's an end still inside of it, so you'll have to see for yourself though. There's a pretty cool lot of features in that mod pack, so I hope you, you guys will download it and see what you like. So let's move this dragon into a nice habitat real quick. So let's move him over here with our other dragons. So we got now our Oni Dragon, Spear Dragon, Gargoyle Dragon. Now let me show you guys the Oni and also Spear Dragon's young form, team form, then adult form. Let me go into the dragon area. Specials. Spooky. We're only missing one more dragon in the entire game guys. I'm so excited. Hopefully by Dragonville Mini episode 22 We will have all the dragons again. I'll call it Dragonville Mini episode 22 Have all the dragons once again or something like that. Hopefully you guys will enjoy that and you guys will be excited But yeah, here's the Oni dragon right near and now I'm gonna show you guys its young form teen form and finally adult form So this is what it looks like as a young little guy. He's pretty cute. I must say I love the mask I believe it's a mask. I could also be wrong about that this is what he's gonna look like as a teen. Pretty big dude, he gets pretty big. And now for his final adult form right here, he's kind of a uh, gargantuan or scary looking. He is pretty big and scary if you think about it. But yeah. Now he is a earth fire cold dragon and has a 12 hour incubation time and also breeding time. Now let's go back into our spirit dragon right here. I love the spirit dragon so much. You know why? Because of the baseball throwing animation it gave. They gave it a baseball throwing animation. That's pretty sick, you guys. But yeah. I'm going to show you guys his young form, teen form, and adult form. Here we go. Young, teen. Now for its adult form. So, this is what it's going to look like as an adult form. Pretty spooky right here. He is a cold and earth dragon, 15 hour incubation time. And I'm going to show you his animation where he throws it like a baseball. So he's got three different animations, and this is the baseball one right here. That is pretty awesome. But yeah. Now, I also want to talk to you guys about a few things. I want to actually roll the dice with Gaia and also Bahamut. So, I did figure out what they meant by uh, they were converting the Rift with the Timida and also Bahamut. Basically, you can roll the dice, and if the dragon's inside the Rift, it will be affected. So, let's say I have a dragon in the Rift. Let's say I go to my Lightning Dragon. Give me a second. Let me find my Lightning Dragon. Lightning Rift. Now, we go to the Rift also. It should pop up right here. Now, if I go to the very bottom... So, let's say, my lightning dragon is actually within the rift. So, you can roll the dice and actually get the dragon to level up. Even though it's inside the rift. So, let me just roll this real quick. And I also found out you cannot move a dragon within and out of the rift anymore. Because of the fact that they didn't want that happening. So, basically, if you have any dragons that are rift dragons outside the rift, that's very rare. And congrats to you guys who guys still have them, though. But, yeah. Oh, we got this guy at level 16. That's pretty awesome. Okay, now, let's take, go to Muhammad. And roll the dice for him. And let's see what dragon we can get. We're going to roll my uh, dragon right here. I don't remember how to pronounce the name. And uh, yeah. Okay. So we got 10,000 food right here. That's pretty awesome. Now let's cook some gold and stuff. And then I also want to go into the racetrack with you guys for a few times. First, let's try to breed that dragon that I had a hard time with. I want to try to get a Lakin dragon, if I could say that right. Let me see. Let me go to the breeding hands real quick. And try to breed this dude. This is a plant, cold, and also lightning dragon. This is the dragon going for hair, Lacken. And the requirements to breed this dragon are the breeding pair of dragons must contain plant, cold, and lightning elements. So we actually got our Zephyr dragon and our plant dragon right here. 
And we're gonna see if we can get it before we head on out of this video for today. So let's see, did we get anything? No, we did not get it. We got a look, we got an ash dragon. Let's keep going until we got it. If we are until I run out of red crystals, either one works. So no, we actually got ourselves an evergreen. We're just gonna sell that real quick and we're gonna keep going until we get it. No, hopefully I can get this. This would be pretty cool if I can get this before we head on out for today. It'd be pretty exciting. Uh, no, we did not get it. Or something else that's really cool. Yeah. Let's see. Come on. Come on. Give us a lichen dragon. Lichen. No, we got ourselves a... Don't know how to pronounce that. My bad. And now let's go for a few more times. I think we can do it like two more times. No, one more time after this one. Okay. Let's see what we got. No, we got an evergreen dragon. That's kind of stinks right there. So yeah, let's see one more time, boyos. One more time, come on! Oof, oof. No, we didn't get anything. We got another ash dragon with a plant trait. I'm gonna sell that real quick. Okay, guys. Before I head on out, I want to tell you guys I will be doing a Dragon Veil World episode on Sunday at 12 a.m. Just to let you guys know, we always do that. So big thing about this episode, though, they did release an event called the Spirit Event for Dragon Veil World, which is pretty exciting. I'm trying to get the Spirit Dragons right now, if we can do that at all possible. But we'll have to see, so it's kind of like on the edge right there. But yeah, uh, hopefully we'll get a spirit crystal. So until then, I'll see you guys in the next one. And stay tuned for more videos, okay? Until then, G-Man out. Well, if you guys did enjoy this video today, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget, you guys are always the best. But until then, I'll see you next time in the next video. G-Man out.